Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your next two month money career reading for the sun, moon and the rising sign of Gemini. Gemini, please keep in mind that this is your group general reading for any personal private reading. You can connect with me on the email ID mentioned in the description box below. Please keep in mind that all personal private readings are paid readings, prepaid, pre-purchased, pre-booked, pre-slotted reading. And you can fix up your live reading over Zoom call, WhatsApp video call, Skype, Google eMeet, whatever suits you. And you can ask as many questions as you want. And yes, if you really like what I do on the channel, please do like, subscribe the channel and put on the notifications. For any personal private reading, do mention your time zone because accordingly I can fix up your call and your video. Now I'm going to pull out two sets of cards, the Oracle card for the month of August and September. And then I'm also going to clarify these cards with the tarot to see and dig deep with your Oracle cards. And this is your general reading, not a personalized reading. A lot of people put questions uh, on the channel. Okay, let us see what messages do we have for Gemini for August. Okay, let us see for September. I check the vibrations of the card. If people are thinking what I check. I check which card needs to come out. Vibration, the connect of the deck is very important with the reader. We rely a lot on the energies of the card. Oh my goodness, Gemini. Welcome the sun in August. The brightest of opportunity. The best of hope. The best of determination. A new beginning. A new start. This is what I am sensing, Gemini. A very bright opportunity. <clears throat> which is not just going to give you the money, the, uh, the finance of your choice. But that is going to give you the name, the fame of your choice. This is going to build up your reputation again in the market. This is going to bring up your word into light. Your work, your word, your attitude into light again. And this is really going to help you big time in time to come. With this energy of the card of sun, I feel that you will also recover. Now, you will not recover the lost money from the same person. But the angels are saying that you will have those opportunities to gain more money, to acquire more money or the opportunities will give you more money than you can either expect or you can earn from that opportunity. So it is going to bring tenfolds luck to you it is going to bring tenfolds fortune prosperity to you just rely on your energies that yes you are a very powerful soul and you can create the magic for yourself this is the energy of sun i'm getting so much from this card in detail let us see what your angel message is you need to trust the process yes you need to trust that the recovery will happen not from the source, same source, but it is going to happen from any other source. The more you trust in the power of your own creation, own innovation, the angels are saying, Gemini, you need to take the lead if you want to change the situation. You want to work harder than before. You want to network more with people. You have to socialize more with people so that you reach out to more and more contact in the month of August. So just analyzing, just dreaming, just uh, waiting is not going to help you out. You need to reach out to people and when you reach out, the results, the outcomes is going to be very, very positive because you have the sun. So trust the process completely that whatever is happening or whatever is coming your way is, is a just a medium to show your worth to people around, is the medium to bring that name and fame into your life and luck. In your monology, we have the waxing moon. Yes, 
this is the card we need at the moment in clarification this says you will be gaining momentum the overall energy will gain momentum because that sun is going to bring that clarity that vision that path in front of you wherein everything will be very clear and the moment you are moving on that path gemini you will start gearing up you will start getting more and more energy to accomplish your goals your target maybe you will filter refilter again but that's okay but your your track your path your goal your target in front of you will be absolutely clear and you will get all the resources the moment you will decide that yes i want to move forward quickly on this path and i'm absolutely ready so the overall energy will try to gain momentum and yes i also feel that you know somewhere down the line emotions might hamper your practical rational logical mind but you need to be very cautious that you are not draining away in any past betrayal any past resentment or anger even if it is coming to you you can say to yourself that i am a powerful soul and i can leave the rest behind i can leave the past behind because i know the clarity i have the bright sun with me and i'm very sure that i'm going to move forward on the path so be very clear about those energies now let us see what messages do we have in tarot let us see the detail we have eight of cups and this is what i was explaining you when i was seeing this card look at to the to the card closely and eight of cups is a presence of uh, you know intuition is a presence of emotions is a presence of cancer scorpio pisces energy into your reading and it says to something in your professional life you have gained you have given your heart and soul but you were not uh, you know reciprocated the way you expected gemini that could be a respect that could be recognition that could be your employer your association counting on your value on your worth and you say goodbye you walk away because you are moving into a new beginning now when you have a card of sun definitely there is going to be a new beginning this new beginning could be a new job new project new contract new association so finally what i see in your august month gemini in your professional life in your money in your career in your finances that you will walk away to what you are currently doing in the past or in the present and you will move towards the new opportunity which is welcoming you which is making you open to explore the possibilities for yourself you have eight of swords so with this you have the angel number 88 yes you want to break the vicious circle of your own thought process of the negative pattern that oh you are not lucky you are not getting that fortune you are not prosperous like others so with this opportunity this opportunity the sun is going to bring you will break all those patterns all those thought processes and you will be willing you will be ready to move into this new path which the sun is bringing in front of you and the other card is the major arcana card the world yes you are completing one major chapter of your life gemini and you are now moving on to another chapter of your life so that is why there is a super ending and there is a super powerful beginning now before i move on to the month of september let us see what do we have with the angel number 88 what messages do we have with 88 it says this is a very auspicious and a favorable sign about your finances your action prayers and visualizations and manifestation work have resulted in a very large inflow of abundance open your arms to receive i'm so happy that when i was reading your card i was telling you to open your arm and receive and it's the same line has been received uh, you know revised by the angel number 88 now let us see what messages do we have for the month of september we have a journey and more than an eternal journey of wisdom of thought process gemini i do feel this is the journey of external movement so this is a work related travel this is a job related travel look at your card the journey is mirroring the sun 
so there is a possibility that you are being asked or motivated or you get a job in a different town in another company at another location another town and trust me that is really going to bring life changing change to your profession and that life changing profession is going to bring huge changes into your personal life so be ready to explore don't say no that oh this is another town another country and i don't want to explore if that resonates with you the profile the kind of work the kind of money please do explore that what this journey is actually giving it to you gemini and the angel message is forgiveness yes and this is absolutely related to 8 of cups because when we are hurt emotionally even when we move physically forward with this journey we feel that oh we have moved on we have left the place and we have chosen the new path we are chosen we have chosen the new opportunity we still hold the resentment regret guilt unforgiveness forgiving will make space for the new to settle well into your heart into your mind into your soul and that newness is going to generate better energies rather than the energies of holding any kind of resentment into your heart let us see what moonology card has to say and it says step out of your comfort zone and this is all about travel what i was sensing is that even if you feel that you have to pull yourself extra you have to expand your boundaries mental emotional physical come out of your cocoon your shell your own assumptions your own limitations because expansion growing wisdom seeing a bigger picture seeing a broader picture is definitely going to help you out and is going to make you more much more comfortable in the new boundary new zone which is not known to you new network new circle of people and there you will find best of exposure for yourself now let us see what messages do we have from your tarot for the month of september we have six of swords excuse me we have the emperor the number 4 and we have the number 4 i am so happy that the masters number are getting repeated let us see what messages do we have with angel number 44 it says the angels are now giving you extra comfort love and support right now ask them for help with everything and listen to their guidance through your own intuition your own vibration your own energy and your own inner wisdom now if i see your these two cards these are very prominent cards that you are building something very rock solid so whatever you are starting in the month of august and september Gemini please know that that is going to stay with you and there is a huge possibility that you might do that particular thing till rest of your life that could be very very long lasting now you know you are also moving from emotions to being more practical more rational more wisdomful but what i see here that that wisdom is bringing you more materialistic gain more materialistic stability and your vision for money your planning for money your strategy for money the way you spend the way you save the way you invest increases improves tremendously with the emperor and four of wands so four of wands says that the happiness is going to bring with this new brand new stability and that is also going to bring happiness in your family because professionally when you earn well you do well money wise career wise financially you definitely resolve things better you give happiness more to yourself there is more contentment and even people around you in your family and friends feel more happy because they see you happy with your professional life so yes you are starting something new that is very very sure with the help of sun there is a travel also but the beauty is that these two cards are confirming that whatever you are starting now is going to flourish is going to grow is going to suit you for sure so if you have a question in your mind whether i should start right now the answer is yes whether it is going to grow prosperous expand the answer is yes okay whether it is going to be long lasting if i put so much of money time energy and efforts 
the answer is yes so yes to all the major queries of your questions related to money career and finances my only concern is the six of pentacles which is definitely showing a journey a travel again but when you are moving forward you are still carrying those resentment those memories which is normal natural try to forget forgive as much as possible on daily basis try to replace when it is coming to your mind quickly say let it be let it go and try to replace with the newness which is coming into your life try to replace with your rebuild work try to invest more time into planning of your next step the more you are involved into planning of your next step next journey into making strategy making plans you will easily involve yourself into the new work so that you can replace the old memory with the newness which is coming with the work with the travel with the movement because the more you are going to hold back the grudges the more you are going back again in past and past which is not going to help you anymore and yes you also have uh, you know the cards of swords into your reading so be cautious of your words your body language your tone in both the months because sword also represents that the communication is going to be effective but the communication is a little going sharp with people with whom you are dealing so you have to be you have to be very sure that you are not hurting people you are not that rude that straight forward that people do not they are not able to resonate with your ideas with your thoughts so be very mindful be very watchful but otherwise both the months are super rocking for you gemini do let me know how you resonated with this detailed reading and i will see you next time very soon be blessed